Hi guys, welcome back to another video of me solving JEE Advanced questions and today I have a JEE Advanced 2022 Paper 2 and it's question 16. So why don't we get into the question. So we can see that this is a linear algebra question and this is my first time teaching linear algebra to you guys so please don't get mad at me in the comments. Well, we have a matrix M which is equal to this and it's telling us to find m to the power 2022. Look, it's it was test it was given to you in the year 2022. Nice. Okay. Anyway, hmm. Well, we can't really raise this matrix by 2022 by hand, can we? Because it's going to get too crazy. So we need to find some characteristics of this matrix to let us have a breakthrough. And then boom we can solve the question well i'm going to rewrite the question here so just rewriting what m is equal to hmm let's see this plus one we'll get to that and this plus one we'll get to that well, look, this means that we have a secret identity matrix hidden in this. Well, if there is one identity matrix hidden in here, then why don't we try to subtract this identity matrix from M? Okay, so we can, so we have M minus I is equal to 3 over 2, 3 over 2 negative 3 over 2, negative 3 over 2. Beautiful. Well, of course we can factor out a 3 over 2. And this is what is so called a nilpotent matrix. Please don't get mad at me if I present if I pronounce this wrong. Nilpotent matrix. That being said, we know that n cubed can be zero, n to the power four can be zero, let alone n to the power two thousand twenty two can be zero. And if you want to, you can change this into three over two n, but I'm just going to do it for you guys. Now we can move the i here, and I'm going to rub this out. M is equal to okay. Now we can raise m to the power of two thousand twenty-two. So, we know that m to the power of 2022 is equal to, time for the expansion. For the first term, it is just i to the power of 2022 plus c 2022 1, which is simply 2022, and then i raised to the power of 2021, and then multiply by this term, to the power of 1. Next, we add C 2022 2 and then I to the 2020 and then multiply by 3 over 2n squared. And then we add all the way to the last term, which is 3 over 2n raised to the power of 2022. Well, what do we do from here? Well, remember when I said that one of the properties of the Nipotin matrix is that in our case, n squared will be 0, and every other power greater than 2 will also be equal to 0. So, we have 
all terms along this bar, like in, there's an imaginary bar, all of these terms, like all the way until here, will be zero, including this term. So we can just rub them out, right? And period. Okay, now this I or the identity matrix we call raised to the power of anything will be itself. So this is still equal to I and then plus 2022 multiplied by 3 over 2n. Okay? And this is equal to if we change the n back and we see that 2022 multiplied by 3 over 2 is this and this cancel. And 1011 multiplied by 3 is 3033. So this is actually equal to i plus 3033 multiplied by the nilpotent matrix, which is 1, 1, negative 1, negative 1. So, my final answer is, if we didn't have the i, there would, then it would all be 3033s. But now that we have the i, we have to add 1 to this term and this term. So, it's 3034. This stays the same. This stays the same. But then we have to add 1 to this term. So, it's negative 3000. And 32. Well, let's look at our choices. So I can just write that the correct answer tick is A. So that is the final answer of this super beautiful linear algebra question. Well, Thank you guys so much for watching and if you enjoy my videos and you like content like this, please consider liking and subscribing. If you want to master something, teach it.